All right. I see the plumes. Let's go get them. This is where the 25, so of course. I'm taking this. I heavily need this. Although I have to be sell to Reaper's hideout. Instead of sovereigns, it's the one downside. But either way, it's gonna be really useful. After I'm done with the skeleton fleet. Oh shot! Uh, it seems someone is doing the skeleton fleet. This is brilliant. What to do then? Hmm. I mean, I need the balloons. I'm just 1,000 away to get the one figurehead that is worth 3,000. 1,000 away. And someone is flappy <laughs> poking holes to my, <laughs> my praise. Anyway, it's a merchant, so of course it has supply advantage. I mean, I can drop this first. I can win. <laughs> One slope fight. Uh huh. Whatever. This is going to be spicy. Yeah, it might, must be the second emission merchant ship I spotted. I mean, I have means to tank the damage, but I have no skills of self-defense in close combat. So what I can do is win by naval. Give me at least one key and one chest and then we are fine. I am not asking more.
just gonna take one key. That must be a duo slope. If it is, I'm in trouble. Maybe negotiations? If possible. Just here for the blooms, nothing more. You can take the rest. Let's see here. First, I need the key. I need to be careful around this part. Just the clones, nothing more. As and keys. Uh -huh. Just as and keys. We are fine. Oh dear. I mean, I could sink him, but I have nothing against him. I could steal it. But he has on board. This is gonna take some while, but I have no time for editing. Yeah, it's there. I scored a little bit. Just gonna here. Sturdy shark, are you? Let I help you. Yep. Oh, sirens, no thank you. Yeah, that's good. Thank you for cooperation. Have a good day, sir. <laughs> I saw. Oh. Is this hitting? No, 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 no. Oh, sorry! Don't worry. 
<laughs> he has a cat. Did he have a cat? Well, I managed to damage some part of his ship. No bad intentions. Now. Oh, it has sound glitch, that's fine. I mean, not bad. Here. Oh, come on. Uh, that's a good amount of supply. Now. Oh! Okay, that's next. And. Extra. Excellent. Hmm. Eh, decent. Basically, the whole idea of the doubloon run is just rushing every world event with the uh, the boost over there and sell it and some random paper. Hideout stuff needs to be sold to get the extra doubloon and see how much you can get sold in six hours or something like that. But since I have no time for six hours, I can spare three hours at best now in this video. So, yeah, how much doubloons do I get? Will I get the fairy man figure head? 3000. Hmm, maybe, maybe not today. Wait. <clears throat> sleepy, sleepy, sleepy. Yowch. Whoa. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, what the frame was that? Woo! I should have been died there. Oh, hell. Time to go to back to ashes. Uh, this one bullet. Is it enough? Nope. And that. Where are you, the blues? You shall be here. Ritual skulls. There we go. Almost level five. There you go. I can rush that, I can get some more doubloons on there. No, wait! Um, hold on. Just the... Uh, well, Athena loot is there. 
Yes. But the uh, one. It's just the one. Uh, a generous gift. Oh boy. Um, I can risk it. I'm gonna sell these when I have them to collect now. Because last time I had good amount of blooms before guild thingy. And I lost them to the freaking team in the fight. So in that same fort. So I'm gonna sell what I have on board now. And uh, go to the fort because that the fort gives gold, but not good amount of blooms if I recall. Compare it to the uh, regular forts. So those are the bloom mines, the regular forts. Then that whole thing. Extra. Not much, but I take it. idea how much the blooms I got that but not that so I guess I need to complete that for then This actually, <clears throat> since that thing doesn't sell much of the doubloons uh, instead of gold, fine, let someone else do the point. I don't care what's in that. All I remember is one Reaper trinket. And then the second one, Satina. Nuekt. Okay. So I'm gonna take the Reaper chest instead and then continue selling the balloons in the process. Question to the viewers, if you have watched this far, I appreciate it very, very much. What is a thing with the waves in this game? What thing, I, if, I may, if you may ask? Well, the waves behavior. The data, the I mean look. We were just in a storm. They became lower uh, higher when we were in a storm. Once we leave the storm the waves are smaller. But what is the data flowing in the waves, you know, how ships behave, and all that 
crazy jazz. If we can see more clearly. If you ever go against the waves. It just bounce the ships. If you have a wind against the waves, full speed, the ship just flow, jumps around these huge waves. How does the waves and a ship with the plenty of objects in it affect the servers? You know. If you think about the Galleon, the fastest ship in the game, with the wind, against the waves, bouncing to the wave, to the wave. How does it affect game's performance itself? I mean, they are already affecting naval combat, because how high they are. I mean, it's a slow comparison. A little bit. If I sit right here, we are just in between that wave and that wave. We are just between them. You can see how much it drops. Isn't that a bit too much? I mean, think again. If you are in open seas in real life, there are moments when you have a wind, but the waves are just five centimeters high. Not five meters high. I really wish if we had a wind, so it would be better to demonstrate. Anyway, the performance, how waves react to the ship in a speed with the plenty of objects in it, in a server performance. If you take a look at the horizon, the galleon going like deer bouncing on the waves, how does it? Affect the game performance, server performance itself. I wonder how much. But that's the question I leave to the those who are watching this video. And believe it or not, but there was a skeleton ship right behind this rock, and it just despawned. And it was a galleon. I imagine if he had the balloons on board, I would be mad. He just said goodbye. I'm off. Ah. Fine then. I will seek a new target. Speaking of which, they already completed the world event. Hmm. Maybe our original fortress appears. Perhaps in Devil's Roar! And I missed that. Hmm. Where do you go next? If the Kraken appears, it doesn't get any to clone, so that sucks. I could try for the skeleton captains, but I have no time for hunting down. They are completely RNG. So... What I can do now... Is just... Completing random world events. Beautiful 25, and that's the port I need. There we go. 
600 away to get the new bow. So figure head. Let's go. This is what I mean that by we don't have full speed, but we are going just enough to make a ship fly in a way. Look, that drop. Is that? Is this really necessary? I mean, it looks beautiful. But ships are not meant to fly in the game to begin with. Uh, I'm just complaining everything on you. I'm just wondering how does it affect the game itself? Wind and the storm, let's see. Oh. Head to the port. Thank you so much. That jump was unnecessary. Below the waves? Did you see? <laughs> we went below the waves. Full speed again. I mean, come on, what is the performance? was cool only in storms but I really want to know how does the waves affect the game any way shape or form just performance just performance alone that's all I want to know Oh no! Hello, Rick. Whoop. Hi, Mercy Sharpeners. Finally, a challenge. Oh. Uh...
Epic Skulls. Me like skulls. Order of souls and the yeet. I had a more keys, that will be fine. This is like sense, I need to... Hmm. Oh yeah, and the um those 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 Ah uh, what else? What else? What else? I had something in mind. I forgot what it was. be delivered. Three paces east. I can do that. Nowhere else to go. Might as well. Risky move, I can do that. I have an idea. <laughs> but why not? <laughs> Take this and the trident. And then I will do the ass and win.
<laughs> okay, some old treasures are here too. Somewhere to hide this keg. Over there, maybe. Those are my 25 doubloons over there. Fine, I take you to. Raymar has summoned me, but first I'll deal with you. Okay, old man, bring it on. Oh, hold up. Hey! Stop, stop, stop! There we go. <laughs> hey! Lucky day. Yay! Come here! Yep, I know. Now time to pick a big bomb! Big bomb. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. Can I do it? Can I do it? Oh Up! Oh. <laughs> oh, I worked the body man. Oh. Where are you? Go back to Ash. Okay. That was new. Why don't you just surrender? You just ate a big bomb. Oh, Why how can don't you, you just surrender? How can you still stand? Box, hit mark, hello. Oh my god, those tridents are weak. What's going on? No hit mark whatsoever. Time to make some money. Accidentally stacked as a lot loot from this island. Let's go. Seven. No, eight. 
And not nine? What's wrong? There you go. Now to leave his hideout. More the blooms awaits. There is the galleon ghost ship. So I'm gonna take that down, and hopefully there's more the blooms than going after world events. See what you have to offer, Skelly Boy. Okay, I did not plan for this. Okay, um, uh, how should I put you down? Just have to kick my ass. Second time Galleons run away! You are supposed to fight, not run! Rare! How did you program... Why they're acting like this? Someone explain. I need explanation. I need explanation for that. You fuck! I hope you put up a better fight than in your bigger version. That's the deal.
You better have to close. But this is the second time a skeleton ship had a kex on board. What's the deal with those? Great examples how to not hold the kegs on your ship. Look at that! Yes, more doubloons. I need a bloody key somewhere. Might as well. Went through it. Time to rip his head out. Five hundred away. Not so rare. Uh huh. Bomb is aboard. Masters there. Yep. Very nice. Maybe some fish. I'm 
maybe have played five. Nothing! Huh! I thought... Now that was a letdown. So Hunter Skull doesn't accept fish like this as a bunch. So what if I... Stay right here. I need to test something. Uh, don't mind about the skeleton music because I think it spawned just underneath this island, so it doesn't get here. Outside. So it's basically stuck. Can you brighten up this dull place? Uh no. Okay. Hmm. Dramatic selling. Very dramatic. I guess I haven't collected enough today. I'm gonna end this over here. Okay. Dramatic. Let's change place for a moment. And now that's the end of this voyage today. So, after wasting three hours or more for this voyage, I'm gonna now upload over something below one hour voyages from three hours in this and uh, this is gonna be a little bit uh, a trilogy or some kind of episodes voyage that I'm going to stack the balloons and sell the balloons until I get 3000 balloons and then I will get my new ship Bow Cosmetic and so on and so forth because if you know that the balloons these days are some sort of difficult to get, but also easy to get. But it only depends on where do you get, where do you find, and how do you acquire the items that sell the balloons. Like I had this journey, I managed to collect a few random uh, ascent chests here and there, but they only require the keys. So required the keys needs me to find Ashen Key Masters, but I have no time for that in the evening, unfortunately. So I'm just gonna hop on every world event that offers all kinds of doubloon selling items like I had in this journey. I managed to collect a huge amount of balloons, and now I'm just below 500 away to get a new ship cosmetic that is probably as old as the game itself and now I'm gonna end this video here before I make this any more longer just for me talking more and more if you like hit the subscribe button subscribe button and like button 
and leave a comment down there below how do you collect the balloons and what do you think about the balloons about cosmetics being sell under day payment of the balloon payment of these new day comment old cosmetics from the past Sea of Thieves times so anyway, my name is LuckyMies205 and I wish you good night, good dreams and good Christmas and so forth and now I leave you here take care and good night and bye bye <laughs> bye bye I'm so bad with these endings <laughs>